Merrick Street, uh, the present moment, is in a very deplorable state. Um, since assuming office, my colleagues and I have made several attempts or efforts to rehabilitate the stretch, but um, due to the drainage situation in the area, uh, the work is rather temporary. Most of the time it lasts like a two months or three months. And um, like I said, it is very costly um, to do street works here in Punta Gorda because at, the, at this minimum here at the town council, uh, we have to buy the material. After paying for the material, we also have to pay for the material to be transported. We also have to hire equipment to, to basically spread the material, compact it, etc. Uh, I have made several attempts to reach out to the Ministry of Works. Um, I was there this morning and I had the opportunity to speak with Mr. Vince Mangar, who is the acting person in charge of the Ministry of Works here in the Toledo District. I was given the commitment uh, on his part that they will be assisting us um, with the transportation of materials. Uh, we here in the part of the town council, we will be sure to purchase uh, the material, quality material from the uh, quarry there in Forest Home. And then I've also made arrangements for the hiring of a grader to come in and work. I've spoken to Mr. Godwin Tillett. The Ministry of Works, I was there this morning and they were having issues with their grader which is what they use to service all the streets here in the district. No? Um, so like I said, I would also like to extend gratitude and thanks to Mr. Dennis Garbutt for um, making the necessary calls to the Ministry of Works to ask them to basically uh, partner with us on this, on this venture here.